so uh hi dear sagittarius a very very good evening to you guys this is anjali tarot and this is our general seven days seven oceans and tarot messages for all the sagis sun moon venus rising from 20 from 18 till the 24th of november 2024 i'm do, i'm going to pull one card for each day and you can take it as messages guidance or warnings or simple plain challenges or obstacles that you might face in the uh coming week okay now if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me you can start your journey by purchasing my course the link is in the description box for the same if you want to start your self healing journey but don't know from where to start you can definitely start with hope ono pono it's the best healing modality for self healing especially and if you want a one on one healing sessions the the like the link of the uh, master class is in the uh, description box for uh, hope ono pono and if you want one on one healing sessions or personal readings you can check out the description box and you can mail me for the same so let's start sagis from 18 till the 24th of november what's coming to you what are the messages for you guys from the oceans and tarot we have for the 18th we have the trust so the more you are going to trust the process trust the universe the more you are going to like flow freely you will be able to get uh, everything crystal clear in front of your eyes basically you are going to get the path uh, while you are walking and while you are having trust in the process and in the universe okay just keep going have patience have trust everything is going to fall into uh, everything is going to fall into place the way it should for you right 19th we have the mind mind is stupid it's either mind or it's peace there's no there's nothing uh, like a there's no term as peace of mind again it's either peace or it's mind according to osho right so uh, on the 19th of november you might feel that you are using your mind too much or your mind is trying to control your life a uh, big 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 time and you're not able to live your life to the fullest because you're not able to use your heart and soul the way you should your mind is taking control of your life and you should not allow it to happen because again mind is stupid it always gives you something so mind always try to protect us in a way it's trying to like protect us from a uh, growth <laughs> so because it doesn't want us to hurt us it doesn't want change it always wants to keep us in some kind of you know bubble but mind is our biggest enemy we have to have a uh, we have to be uncomfortable we have to go out of our comfort zone for growth for expansion of our soul right so anyways i can't give you a lecture anymore <laughs> so anyways we have the 1920 18 19 and 20th fighting on the 20th of uh, november you are going to find yourself in an uncomfortable position where you might have some kind of uh, like uh, uh, disagreements you know with other people other energies and you might have uh, you might have the tendency to fight it's like the more you are going to fight the more you are going to try to prove your point to somebody the more you are going to lose the point the point here is you have to understand that other people other energies are different from you even if that your twin brother or sister doesn't matter right and you have different uh, lifestyle you have different perspective you have different understanding you have different vision and so they are so they are, uh, uh, so they are right so all you have to do is try to understand that uh, everyone is different everyone have a different mindset and try not to be a part of any kind of drama or issue try to protect your energies at any cost hmm 21st we have the postponement so you might end up some, having some kind of postponement or delays or some kind of frustration regarding some kind of project or something that you are working on but this is something that is going to give you the time to reflect on yourself your energies and what your inner self is trying to tell you in this case try to learn the lesson out of the situation instead of getting frustrated or angry about it try to understand what what this situation is trying to tell you here what uh, this situation is trying to teach you here hmm hmm Okay, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-first, twenty-second. We have the aloneness. Ah, almost same reading as Virgo. Maybe you have Virgo in some uh, Virgo somewhere in your chart. So twenty-second, we have the aloneness. You are going to choose to be alone for some time for your own good. It's like choosing the path of walking alone on your path deliberately. Nobody is forcing you to do that, but you are going to understand that sometimes all you have to do, you have to walk on the path. on the journey yourself nobody else is going to help you in that and it's like no this person is not sad or something this person knows that this is the right path so you are going to understand that point hmm? on the 22nd 23rd we have the compromise in order to find peace in a situation you have to find the middle ground that that's in that situation otherwise you might end up uh, losing the person losing the situation losing us uh, losing something losing something quite important to you 
so find a middle ground find a compromise and then move forward accordingly and you will be able to find a solution to the problem that you are facing in a particular situation but compromise is required finding a middle ground is required 24 we have the schizophrenia so sometimes we don't understand what we should do should we let go of this part or that part or should we let go of everything and everyone uh, uh, like all at once so in this particular card osho wants to uh, osho zen in this particular card of osho zen tarot this is something that you have to let go of everything at once just trust the universe and just fall freely and everything is going to be sorted when the timing is going to be right so basically leave everything and everyone behind that's not aligning with your energies anymore and trust the process and the universe and you will be able to find out the solution while you're going to walk on that path with trust yeah so thank you so much for tuning in sagis i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste